Andrew Haspin here sitting or standing in front of our new listing at 3284 West 35th Avenue in Vancouver, Mackenzie Heights neighborhood. We've got a 1940 vintage uh, character home on a 37 by 130 foot lot. Let's go take a look at it. Uh, the lot is, um, we're just located about uh, one block to the uh, east of Blenheim Street. So great school catchments, Point Grey Secondary, and Carisdale Elementary are the uh, school catchments. I'm just going to swing around here, show you the streetscape. It's a beautiful street. It's quiet. This is rush hour, so you can see what it feels like at rush hour, about 6 o'clock. Okay, I'm going to take a peek inside. Uh, the home, uh, it's got a cross hall living dining. So on the left side here, we're going to go into the living room. Wood burning fireplace. Some cove ceilings. And original hardwood floors, oak with the inlay. And they could use a fresh sanding, but they're... Uh, in pretty good shape. The house, the house has uh, got all hot water baseboard heating. Boiler in the house is about six years old. And these are the original leaded windows at the front. Some nice detail. So living room. And then across here to the uh, dining area. And I'm gonna walk into the kitchen, which was fully renovated about 12 years ago. Beautiful kitchen, granite countertops, new cabinetry, um, undermount lights, as you can see, nice appliances, got a sub-zero fridge over there, Bosch oven, convection oven, a gas cooktop. So the kitchen's actually uh, quite a special feature about the house, even a wine fridge, undermount sink, as your dishwasher. So it's a long galley kitchen, and if I swing around here, I'm sort of standing in kind of an eating area nook. And then we can look out over the backyard. Again, this lot is 37 feet wide, so uh, a little bit wider than a standard 33. No garage, but a garage could easily be uh, could be built. And you can also do a laneway house at the back as well. So uh, off the kitchen, I'm going to open this door to the sun deck. It's not a sunny day today, but it gives you the idea. Big deck at the back of the house. And you can sort of get an idea of the uh, backyard. Lots of light. We're facing southwest. Okay. Gonna head back into the house and we'll just do a quick whiz of the stairs. Um, nice feature about the home, uh, it has a three bedroom suite in the basement, fully self-contained with its own laundry. And uh, it's got two bathrooms downstairs. The suite's in great shape. Fortunately, we can't see it unless someone makes an offer that's accepted. But uh, I've seen it and it's full height basement down there as well, which is great, uh, almost eight foot basement. So bathroom on the main floor, renovated. Also, I think about 12 years ago, undermount sink, granite, soaker tub, tile floor, even a heated towel bar and newer windows. A lot of the house has newer vinyl windows. Nice, main floor, large master bedroom. So it can easily accommodate a queen, a king size bed should you wish to. Again, those windows are upgraded vinyl windows. And then we go up the stairs to the upper level. And upstairs, we're gonna find uh, two large bedrooms, one small bedroom with a tiny bathroom, just a half bathroom upstairs. So this is a small bedroom with a little small half bathroom. Laundry's upstairs as well. So there's your laundry. Straight down this hallway to a large bedroom. Again, easily accommodate, well that is a king size bed, so you can see it easily fits a king size bed. Room for a desk as well. Then there's kind of an unfinished area in the attic, which could be increased um, closet area. Uh, flex room, whichever. There's some low ceiling, but in the middle it's full height. And the last bedroom is the third bedroom upstairs. Again, another large room. Could easily get a, a king size in here or a queen. Right now there's just a single with a desk. Big bedroom. And again, we're going to look out over the back of the property. 
see it's a nice nice outlook on the back side okay other features about the home which are not evident from this video the electrical was all upgraded in the house about uh, uh, eight nine years ago so there's no knob and tube left in the house the oral tank was re removed in 2005 and um, again if you're interested in viewing the home it's by appointment only and um, the basement suite if you're interested can be viewed upon an accepted offer the tenants downstairs are month to month uh, great tenants i've been in the suite it's very clean and again full height ceiling down there and it shows very very well uh, the price on this home is two million five hundred and twenty eight thousand and if you have any further questions feel free to reach back and would be happy to show it to you andrew hasman from remax we'll see you soon